So the reason we're interested in Post Office Rock is just the extreme nature of the erosion that is ongoing here. In the last, well, since 1940, uh, it's eroded about 100 metres and in quite a unique fashion. By having a map of the seafloor and hopefully being able to capture some movement in these transverse dunes, we'll be able to see after the erosion where the sand is going and why it is not replenishing the coast as sometimes and most often happens. With continued sea level rise and future climate change, we're just going to see much more of this kind of event taking place. So it's a good proxy of what we expect to take place uh, much more commonly by 2050, 2100 than is currently the case.